Meet Nimrod Barkan, Israel's new ambassador to Canada. Barkan was born in Yad Eliyahu, a neighborhood in Tel Aviv named after Eliyahu Golom, a commander in the Haganah, a pre-state Jewish militia. The neighborhood was built, believe it or not, for British Army veterans. Barkan's father was a Holocaust survivor from Hungary. At the age of 15, he sailed on a clandestine immigration ship, arriving in Israel with one small suitcase. Barkan's boyhood dream was to be a garbage collector. Going around the city emptying garbage cans every morning seemed to him to fulfill his desire for action. When he was older, he knew that he wanted to have an impact, and he decided that the way to do it was through the foreign ministry. Barkan is a history student at the Hebrew University of Jerusalem, specializing in the Middle East. As a diplomat, he served in Philadelphia and in Cairo, where he survived two major terrorist attacks. In Israel, he worked closely with the late Shimon Peres, who was the foreign minister at the time and afterward served in Washington, San Francisco, Paris, and now Canada. The most important challenge, according to Ambassador Barkan, is to explain Israel's situation to the world. In his conversations with skeptics, He uses research-supported facts to get his points across. As head of policy research at the foreign ministry, he was instrumental in formulating the diplomatic plan to end the Second Lebanon War in 2006. As a result of his experience, Barkan was given the task of rebuilding the Center for Policy Research. When he was head of the Bureau of World Jewish Affairs and World Religions, Barkan expanded activities to combat anti-Semitism restore Jewish property lost during Holocaust, and coordinate pro-Israel actions of Jewish communities abroad. Ambassador Barkan's involvement in international organizations aided him in promoting Holocaust commemoration and exposing the new Yad Vashem Museum to the world. Although in his professional life, Barkan is known to weigh every word he utters, he is actually a very spontaneous person. He loves to sing with his daughter and granddaughter, spontaneously. The bees are buzzing in the tree to make some honey just for me. Nimrod Barkan loves theater, films, and museums. And a little-known fact, cries in the movies. His favorite films are The Jungle Book and Star Wars. Serving as Israel's ambassador to Canada is for me the peak of my 40 years diplomatic career. It is a pleasure to serve in a country that, like Israel, is striving to create a melting pot based on immigrant communities coming from all parts of the world, trying to build a one society while retaining the ethnic identity and the cultural identity of each community. I hope that we will be able to do that together. I will do my best to bring the Israeli message to Canada and to bring the Canadian message to Israel. And I hope that we'll have a great time together doing it. Thank you very much.